projects are the most important one that you should right now it does not matter if you are a manual tester fresher or automation tester already right projects are far 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 more greater than as the resume that you are creating in this video i'm going to talk about the important projects related to selenium five important ones we're going to talk about how you can use expresso crm a heat map ones free gst ones right invoice plane and multiple types of the projects that you need to basically learn immediately not only that i'm going to discuss about must learn selenium concept that you should be covering all of them along with this so i'm going to discuss about what are the project domain what is the technology stack they are used what are the key things that you are going to learn as well as what are the skills that you need to gain into by learning or by doing this project the best thing about this project is that you can already basically add them into your resume also even if you are a fresher no 90 or even as a manual tester you can you can add them so let's jump into it directly what are the top selenium project that everyone must have to do even though they think and not only that i'm going to give you one very important level one and level two challenges also how to do that which framework to use how exactly what is the solution for them also we are going to see that okay let's go with that first one which is my favorite which is called as expresso crm guys the first project we are discussing is called as the expresso crm it's a crm which is a customer relationship management tool right what exactly will you will learn it's a docker based first of all you need to remember you will learn how to basically install the docker how by using the docker you can basically run this project directly you can see that it, there is a free demo available where you can test it out directly. If you have a username, password, you can directly log in and you can test it out multiple things. But if you need, you can also install directly into by using the Docker also. So what are the things that you will learn especially into this, right? This is very, very important. This project is basically made in PHP, MariaDB, MySQL, right? You will learn few important things. What are the important things? You will learn things like how to handle the dropdown, how to handle the custom buttons, how to handle a dashboard, how exactly you can use a web table. You will learn how exactly input message, radio button and other form instruction that you need to learn to become an automation tester. All these are very, very important thing you need to understand all these important things by the way guys into my must learn selenium concept you know maximum number of concepts related to locator handling elements and form handling all these are basically covered into this expresso crm so make sure you check it out link i'm going to discuss and give into the chat all the links related to project one project two project three will be given to you make sure that you type projects into the chat guys just type project into the chat i will give you the link right second important project which everyone must have to do is called as the heat map of vw guys this is a very important concept i used to remember when i was working in wingify this is one of the complex scenario that you can automate what you need to do is you need to open this url hover over these elements the based on this element in a new window will open and based on this window you will get the things that you do like how exactly this heat map you need to verify you need to verify how many click max like how many clicks are there you have to switch different between different windows and everything also right all this we have already automated in one of the scenario if you want to see like how exactly it can be automated in the previous batches we have already automated this just you need to search for for example 10x in the 10x learning selenium you will find the solution for this also how exactly we have done this heat map challenge in somewhere in if you go to here also right heat map challenge we have already done in the here in the action classes and everything in the project session you will see we have done this heat map challenge so heat map part one part two this is the test project interview that we have done this is where the solution is how we have automated you need to learn this concept very very well again you will learn handling windows switching action classes hovering an element drop down canvas handling and there are multiple things you will learn in this case it's a very complex i would suggest you to go ahead and learn it do it this exercise by yourself and just do it okay third important project which is a simple password generator guys this is a very simple one but again not that difficult what is this a simple password generator that you will see uh the link is available here i'm going to share with you guys also genpass.lovable.com uh this is the link by the way guys the password which is this this is a very simple password generator what exactly you will learn the concept of regex verification the concept of radio boxes the concept of slider the multiple things you will learn for example here you can select this by using the slider you can basically generate a generate a password now you can verify the regex of this password you can verify if this is uppercase or lowercase or not 
So this is can you can understand these are the things which are important concept in selenium. In real life, you should know how to handle these scenarios, right? So that's why it is important. I think personally, it is very very important that you should definitely learn about this. So this is project number three, password generator and all. Solution will be available. You can check it out my repository. It is very good. fourth one, which is invoice generator, guys. Zoho invoice generator. This is one of the open source project where you will add certain information and it will generate a beautiful beautiful what we call a invoice now interesting thing is you can download this invoice and or you can print this invoice this is what you can do you can basically sell tell them to print it after the print so make sure that you add it you need to verify also so what exactly you need to learn is you need to download the pdf and verify so pdf parsing and working with pdf so you can use pdf box for this there is a beautiful library which is created in java with selenium that you can use to parse it and use it guys this is again a very important pro problem statement in techion in wingify in browser stack i have used this where you need to download a pdf and verify so just give it a try this is another project that i would su suggest you to do that you need to download one of this and basically verify this is very very important now fifth one which is a very important which i would suggest you have each and everyone to try out i'm going to share the my personal framework also this is uh, if you go to 10x 10x batch we have by the way already finished this is the advanced selenium framework that you can go ahead this framework that you can definitely use now what you need to do is this is what the website is guys this is a full website when you open this website directly into a incognito mode now this is a end to end scenario please remember this is a end to end scenario what you are going to do is if you open this you need to enroll into this course by adding your email id suppose this is my email id that i have right this is my email id suppose i would add one i will continue now i will basically set my username and password so this is my email id i am enrolling into a particular course so if i am continue so now my enrollment is done i will enter some of the details like this is my username password i will just enter a password also so some random password i will just use you need to use the same thing uh, random password this is a registration that we are doing guys for a course this is what you are doing you need to do this this is by using selenium what you can do is now you need to click on start and you need to basically complete this course by clicking next 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 just click next just click next make click next next and this is what you need to do and you need to verify one interesting thing i'll show you what exactly you need to verify here you can see we have something called as 33% which is done right i would suggest you to go ahead this is like a real case scenario i'm telling talking about this is one of the automation project that we have done it's an open source again you can use the same framework same project into your you can upload them add them into your resume also no worries but what you need to do is after next you will see the percentage is basically getting changed so make sure that you need to reach it to the 100% the moment it is 100% you will get a congratulation message and this one you need to verify this is a very important thing that you can verify and you will see after this six out of six lessons are completed this is again you need to verify this is a very important complete this by using the page object model i would highly encourage all of you another bonus point if you want to look looking for a multiple more projects ki sir i want more and more projects of course we have website for practice where we have more than 11 plus websites related to selenium uh, automation related api testing advanced selenium top tier projects and multi more more this list is completely updating you can check it out another one which is my favorite also which is a fake bank this application that i have specially created for you guys what is this so this is one of the way <laughs> a fake bank application but again it is a good application that you can work with you can click on login there are login credentials which are given to you the moment you login right what you will see a this is a very close to real but you will have a balance so you can basically transfer some money suppose i will transfer to uh, okay ICI CI right i am transferring like 20000 rupees and this is my rent suppose and click on continue complete the transfer now what you need to verify is if you go back to dashboard you will see it is getting deducted and the money is 20000 rupees only right so this is how you can try out again suppose if i basically try to transfer 20000 rupees let's try to transfer the 35000 rupees and let's go this and you can see insufficient balance so these kind of things also you can try out you can have your loan application for other things these are basic things that you can basically try out and let me know if these are important so these are the projects that i highly recommend which everyone has to do and most important thing is you need to upload them into your github repository also guys make sure each and every one when you are done with this you upload them into your automation repository like this for example this is a one of the selenium autom automation framework that we have created from scratch you need to upload them into your github repository to showcase thanks for watching i hope this video helps put projects in the chat i will share all the links with you thanks a lot i'll see you in the next video make sure to check it out bye bye enjoy